Hey everybody, it's I Want To Be Retro. Today we're going to take a look at installing Invoice Ninja on Linux. To begin, launch a terminal and run sudo apt update to update your software repositories. Then we'll use apt install to install a few prerequisite packages required to get Invoice Ninja installed. Next we'll add the PHP GPG key and apt repository. Then we'll run sudo apt update again to pull in the new packages from the PHP apt repository, followed by an apt upgrade to install any available software updates. Now we use apt install to install the Apache web server and MariaDB database backend, followed by another apt install to install PHP and the required PHP modules. Next, we'll elevate to a root shell using sudo su, then execute the MySQL secure installation script. Follow the prompts to set a root MySQL password and mitigate known vulnerabilities. Next, we'll connect to our MySQL database. Then using SQL commands, we'll create an Invoice Ninja database, as well as an Invoice Ninja service account with full permissions on the new database. Then we'll flush MySQL privileges and close the MySQL connection, and exit our elevated root shell. We'll use regular expression to look up the latest Invoice Ninja release from GitHub. Then we'll download it using wget. We'll extract the downloaded Invoice Ninja source code to var www, then set permissions on the storage subdirectory. We'll make a copy of the example Invoice Ninja M file, then create a new Apache configuration file for Invoice Ninja. Copy the site configuration from the video description, then paste it in the file. Save your changes and close out of the nano editor. Next, we'll make some changes to the default HT access file. Locate the last rewrite rule about eight lines from the bottom of the file and add slash invoice ninja slash before index.php. Save your changes and close the nano editor. Now we'll set the owner of the invoice ninja directory to the www data group. We'll enable the Apache rewrite module as well as our new invoice ninja site then restart the Apache 2 service for the changes to take effect. Open a web browser and navigate to the DNS or IP address of the host slash Invoice Ninja. Enter the full URL that will be used to reach Invoice Ninja and uncheck the require checkbox across from HTTPS. Then click the test PDF button. Using the video description as a guide, complete the database connection details then click test connection. Configure your email server, or leave the setting as log and click send test email. And finally, create an account by entering a first name, last name, email, and password, and checking the I agree to terms boxes. Then click submit. Log in using the email address and password we entered on the previous screen. Enter a company name and select the light or dark theme, then click save. Welcome to Invoice Ninja, an invoice and payment manager running on your Linux device.